Well, here we are in Vienna and doing a simulation of damage stability. Uh, this is perhaps the most uh, complex simulation of its type that's ever been made anywhere in the world. We've replicated the hull of the ship to such an extent that uh, almost 740 separate compartments are modeled to scale. We've picked an absolutely worst case scenario. Well, as you can see just from the size of that latex patch, it's a significant damaged area, almost unprecedented. The ingenious thing about using the latex is when they simply slit it with a knife, that will allow for, I guess what you'd have to call a catastrophic flooding of, of the vessel. The, the initial list of 15 degrees shows the residual survivability that the ship has. That's probably as much as it will go over in an instant. The ship will then stabilize because it has a lot of reserve uh, stability, a lot of reserve buoyancy in the rest of the ship, which is sufficient to keep the ship afloat. What we're trying to see now is how the water has migrated through, through the vessel, uh, especially on the higher decks. Uh, it's been w very well confined to the area that was intended. This is a damage that would have been catastrophic for most ships. I think she's going to provide um, all the stability and buoyancy that we would need to uh, make sure that we could stay on board and would not have to abandon the ship.